So welcome everybody to the VRV channel and today we are going to be talking about the latest virus <clears throat> trend on TikTok called the milk crate challenge. In this vi <clears throat> trend, you might think that you have to drink a whole crate of milk, but this is TikTok. Ain't nothing normal here. So basically you have to stack up a stack up milk crates in a pyramid formation, try to walk over them without die <clears throat> falling, and apparently people are calling this the Hood Olympics. I mean, that is true, because since the Olympics finished, people need some type of stupid and heavy air quotes sports event. So enough of me rambling. Let's start watching some of these idiotic videos. You got it? What? I got it, I got it, I got it. <laughs> so as you saw in the video, this challenge is deadly. You might try to become famous on TikTok by participating in the Hood Olympics, but believe me, you won't come out without a wound or dying. Like, I'm pretty sure that this is just a glorified way of suicide. Now let's watch another one of these monstrosities. Okay, now, one fact is confirmed, that this shit dumb. Like, it's not as if you are winning the real Olympics, you are just calling to die. If I would do something like this, I would probably get beaten up by my well. Anyways, let's continue. Crazy. Oh my god. Okay, so I just made up a meme in my head. Like, TikTokers are like, oh, we get satisfaction by doing all these challenges. Like, bro, you get, ch you get satisfaction by dying? Getting injured? Bruh. I mean, why would people go to such lengths for clout? It is stupid. And that's the reason why I think clout is heavily contagious. Even more contagious than COVID-19. Okay, first of all, what the hell is this music? You're not doing something great. You're not freaking Superman. You're just trying to die. Anyways, let's carry on. Hey, she don't know what the fuck to listen to. Hey, everybody saying go south, go west, go east. Come on, man. Hey, I'm gonna buy you a song. Bitch, 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 bitch. Let's get it. Hey, let's get it. Okay, so apparently people are also doing prize pools for this shit. I mean, $10,000 for dying? I would like that kind of money, but seriously, don't do the shit for money in cloud. You can go get a better, better paid job than this. Like, if you're Bill Gates, probably. Not like normally, but you would have a stable earning. And people are also deliberately trying to make people fall down or injure them while they're on the crates. People are literally kicking off the foundation of the crates to hurt people. I don't know if this is supposed to be funny or they have some type of agenda against these people, but who am I to say? <laughs> I knew that this challenge was idiotic, but come on, you don't have to make it a thousand times worse. I mean, come on. Am 
Mind you, people have landed in the hospital after doing this challenge. I mean, who didn't think that somebody eventually was gonna land in the hospital because of this? These types of challenges are known for the injuries. Like the Kiki challenge, there's bound to be someone injured. Just add this to the list of injurious TikTok challenges. Now, I'm gonna show you a video talking about all the injuries and how much did those medical bills actually cost after getting hurt in the stupid challenge. We're gonna talk about the milk crate challenge, all the injuries and all the medical fees that everybody is stacking up and racking up. Got all the reports right here. This guy right here, 82 years old doing the milk crate challenge. Funeral expenses, $15,000. This guy right here, two bruised ribs, $65,000 in medical expenses. A gluteus maximus explosion. His left cheek exploded. Medical expenses, $132,000. This guy right here, they convinced him to do the milk crate challenge for $50 and a bag of flaming Hot Cheetos. A cracked cranium, $85,000 in medical expenses. This guy right here shattered his elbow, $32,000 in medical expenses. Bruised ligament on the inner thigh. $42,382. Broken back. $282,000 in medical expenses. Rehab and everything. Stimulus check, gone. All those medical expenses you racking up. Your stimulus check just walked out the front door. So apparently, there was an 82, 82 year old doing this challenge and then he got injured and sent to the hospital yep 82 year olds trying to be the next dixie d'amelio or charlie d'amelio on tiktok i mean they should know that if they fall down their body's probably gonna crack into two pieces like people are still attempting this challenge even after all these injuries not knowing how much their family will have to spend on their medical bills if you're watching this and you're thinking of doing this challenge regardless of the consequences please don't i don't endorse any of this tomfoolery i mean if you want to die i guess you can but other than that i don't see a reason to doing this except cloud and fame I mean, my generation is freaked. Even I don't understand what half the people of my generation think or what is going on in their mushy brain. This challenge, according to the Washington Post, started on a website called Know Your Meme with a video called Guy Falls Off Six Milk Crates, which was posted in June 2011. Let's watch this video. Oh, oh, f I think I'm out for the season. <laughs> up here, you can see the mark. I'm out great last. Oh, uh, that's pretty. All right, that's it for today, guys. I hope you liked this video, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and turn post notifications on for more weekly uploads. That's me signing out. Sayonara and peace. And don't do this challenge. I'm telling you, if you do this, just unsubscribe from me, bro.